some social media questions. Jim McNally on the Larry King Now blog. What advice can you give to someone who wants to get into the airline business? Uh, have a model that people want. You know, keep it simple. I think the I have seen such complexity in the airline business. And I think what AirAsia did was we just used the word KISS, keep it simple, stupid. And it's a constant thing I'm telling my staff as we grow. You know, you cut that bureaucracy, keep it things simple. So my, my advice is one, make sure you have a product that people want. And two, keep it simple and keep the cost low. Are you always going to be low cost? Yeah. So yeah. You, when you fly from Malaysia to uh, San Francisco? Yeah, it's low cost, but we'll have, we, we just, we keep it low cost, but we have better seats. That's how I deem it. So you can, pay, you can pay for a better seat. So that's kind of our business product. Teresa Fullerton on the Larry King Now blog. What American airline is doing it right? She says they all seem bad. JetBlue. I'm impressed yeah, with JetBlue. What Blue. do they do? Well, their, their people seem to like working for them for a start. You know, the crew are great, both on the ground um, and the air. I think their product is great. They're, they're kind of in between, though. They're a little bit kind of hybrid, right? A little bit Frankenstein. Are they full service? Are they low cost? But from a, from a flying member, there is no product in America that, in my opinion, comes close to their product and their passion for what they do. They're yeah. a great airline. They have that first class. Yeah, Mint. Mint. Yeah. What a great flight. Yeah. Place. I flew from uh, San Francisco to New York. Um, obviously, I know them, so they may treat me a little bit better, but you can see the way they interact with other passengers and... And I haven't heard a bad word about them. I know David Nealman when he yeah. first started it. Uh, Virgin think, America is pretty good. Yeah, but they're now gone. They're Alaska now. Yeah. Alaska bought them. Janice Everett on the Larry King Now blog. When is the best time to get a good deal on airline tickets? <laughs> Early. Uh, well, you know, the sales all over the place. Um, the internet has made it very transparent now, you know, kayak pricing and stuff. But we operate on a simple economic theory. The earlier you buy, the cheaper it is. Is it still true someone said you could walk down an airplane, ask everybody what they paid, and everybody would be different? 100%. Because? Well, because we work on demand and elasticity. We're a classic economic elasticity model. Create demand when there isn't, by low fares, and charge a little bit more when there's demand. I mean, getting a car yesterday in the Grammys was a classic case <laughs> of surge pricing. <laughs> <laughs> Alicia Platt on the Larry King Now blog. When will airlines make airline travel more travel more comfortable? Yeah, I think they, we're getting there. Even on a low-cost airline, I think we have a good product. Um, we're working on seat technology all the time. Uh, Boeing is working on better cabin pressure, so it feels better. I think our food is fantastic. Yeah? Uh, yeah. We believe in it so much, we're going to start a fast food restaurant um, out of it. It's called Santan. So, um, and then I think the worst experience is the airport experience, the check-in experience, the bags, you're losing your bags, you know, there's that nervousness of will your bag turn up? And I think a lot of technology is coming. I think this whole technology revolution, the airlines are gonna grab at it. We're working on face technology so they can board. We're working with governments so you can get pre-approved. You don't have to stand in queues. And uh, better security techniques. What do you mean by cabin air pressure? So, you know, the higher you go, you're pressurized. And uh, that's why sometimes you feel really tired out of a plane. And so the new Dreamliner and some of the new Airbuses have, have much better pressurization. So you feel like you're on the ground. Is that Dreamliner the best plane now? I better not say that because I have a lot of friends both in Boeing and Airbus. But it's a good plane. It's a good plane. But Airbus have got a great plane as well in the, in the 350. Someone said these planes now fly themselves. They virtually do. I always tell my pilots, you know, I'm paying you a lot of money just to drive the plane to the takeoff, take it off, and then you're on autopilot. Even the landing now is virtually... They land themselves, Yeah, right? it's virtually instrument landing. So there is a dream that one day, you know, there'll be pilots in not, some room. Not robots, but, <laughs> not robots. UAV pilots. <laughs> It'll happen. Self-drive planes. Never miss a beat. Subscribe to Larry King now and watch new episodes every day.